Hi everyone! I am just gonna chat to you a bit about one of my um, favourite films of recent times called Hunt for the Wilder People. Some of you may have heard of it, some of you may have seen it. Um, if you've seen it, you probably know why it's one of my favourite films of recent times. Now, Hunt for the Wilder People, it stars Sam Neill and the protagonist, Ricky Baker, uh, is played by Julian Dennison. Uh, these two actors have a lot of chemistry and work really well together. Now, the premise of the film is Ricky Baker is a foster child and uh, they can't find somewhere for him to stay so he ends up staying with the Sam Neill character whose name escapes me and his wife and this is a last resort. Now um, this particular film is really really great because not only does it tug at the heartstrings it's also really quirky and really funny as well lots of laughs to be had um i wouldn't say this is a spoiler but the um because it's early on in the film but there is a particularly fun song um a version of happy birthday made by ricky's now auntie um and sung to him with a small keyboard and great enthusiasm. It's a lot of laughs. Um, so if you haven't seen it, I'd recommend you watch it. It's um, based on the book, I think it's called Wild Pork and Watercress, which was relieved, released rather in the 70s. Um, look out for characters like Psycho Sam and um, a dog named Tupac and all sorts. Um, it's uh, based in New Zealand so there's a few um, Kiwi references in there so look out for some of those, maybe do a bit of a, a Google search to um, look up some Kiwi vocab so you've got your head around some of the words they use. Um, yeah, I'll look forward to the next film by this particular director, Taika Waititi. Um, he's also done films including Boy, which is really, really good, and What We Do in the Shadows, which I actually haven't seen yet, so maybe I should get onto that. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed my little chat on Hunt for the Wilder People. Um, I'll see you next time. Bye.